All right, so I joined a modded server on Rust and found the Tower of Babel, literally. It is just endless stairs, and I feel like I've got to be getting close now. I've been waiting to record, just thinking, you know, that this might be it, but I, let's just see how high this really is. Somebody actually sit and sat here and spent the time to make a tower that goes seemingly forever. Just look at that view. <laughs> this is awesome. I did not expect to see this. There's an entire uh, city below all that. Uh, and there's some over here too, or more buildings. You can barely see them from up here. But I'm going to continue the ascent. See how high this really is. And if there's anything at the top. I already kind of have an idea of what I want to do for a celebration. <coughs> Once I reach the top. can't sprint either. I mean, you could, but it would be pointless because you couldn't. I wouldn't want a chance to turn and missing it and falling off here. Literally the last 15 minutes I've been climbing this thing. Maybe 20. It's like giving me arthritis. I'm going to spin my mouse so slow. I just can't believe how much wood this must have taken. Somebody had to have had to just spawn this with admin powers or something. I can't see somebody doing all this on their own without... Oh. Everything's gotten really blue. I think I'm hitting the skybox here. Or it's just turning night. Either one. Skybox, there is no skybox. This thing is just forever. I'm not going to inch out any further. I'm not falling off. Now, I spawned like, you know, just a few feet from this giant tower of Babel here, and uh, I was just amazed at what I saw, so I thought, hey, I'm going to climb it, just spawning in. I have nothing to lose. I mean, look at that. Nothing. Just get what you start with. So if I die from starvation climbing this, it's just going to be pretty funny. I've been trying to keep the momentum up. Sometimes there's fire pits in the way. Or uh, furnaces, I mean. And sleeping bags, but those don't really block your path. The furnaces, however, they can be annoying. <sighs> this just does not stop. I mean, holy shit. I wish I would have at least brought a sleeping bag, because... I will never make this climb again. This is why I started the recording, because there's no fucking way. I'm going to dedicate this type of patience to climbing a fucking tower. And that's the type of shit I'm talking about. There's nothing in it. Just the thing to block your path on your ascent up into endless stairs. Stairway to heaven or the path to hell? Is this. has got to be killing my character's legs by now. I'm gonna run out of torch before I get to the top. Got 270 seconds worth of torch. Incoming air drop. Oh my god, I would laugh my. Fucking ass off if I can get hit by this plane. 
Oh, I'm not. Should I? No, I'm not going to jump on it. I'd probably pass right through it. It's pretty wild, though. To watch that. There's no drop of that. It didn't drop anything. Or if it did, it, I can't see it. Alright, well, that wasted. I don't know. Probably two minutes. Doesn't matter though, because the stairwell probably doesn't end. There's got to be an end. Now I'm, I'm just curious. That's the only thing that's keeping me going now. I wanted to jump off and land on the plane, see if that would either kill me or what would happen. It would probably just pass through it. And besides, it took way, way too much time and dedication just climbing these fucking stairs. It wouldn't have been worth it. Now without knowing what's up here. What truly is at the top of this fucking forever tower. It's probably why no one's in the server. Or it's because it's four o'clock in the morning where I'm at. Either way. Starve climbing these stairs, I tell you. Fifty seconds of torch left. Oh. This is dizzying. Who did this? I mean, seriously, has an infinite amount of patience. Where this just took weeks of dedication and coming back and adding on, adding on. I'm just curious, when does it stop? Is there a sky cap? Nope. No more torch. All silhouettes from here. Till daybreak. Should be coming soon. No. This is bullshit. I think I'm, you know, I'm definitely higher than any mountain. <sighs> this is this is nice and walled in. Were they afraid of getting sniped? I'd laugh. Just to see someone try and shoot me from this high. Not saying they couldn't, but it would be hard. Really hard. <clears throat> uh, now it makes me wish I started recording a little later. But then I would have missed the plane. That was pretty cool. It just gives you a little bit of an idea. I've already suffered in, what did I say, 15, 20 minutes prior to recording from start, so... I was hoping that this would end a while ago. Let's see. Day 
nighttime couldn't come any sooner. Come on. It's been nighttime for seemingly forever. And it looks like day is going to come. purpose of this tower just came to me to test if this game has a height limit how high can you possibly go in this game and how long will it take me to hit the ground if I jumped from here not from here from the top and that question can only be answered for the few and brave that are brave enough to make the climb. See? So people put sleeping bags. See, that's the burden though, you know. Why would you want to respawn up here? I mean, if you really wanted to continue playing, that means you would have to go and walk all the way down the stairs. And that is just a fucking... I mean, you can tell. I mean, going down is probably not going to be much faster than going up. Not by much. And uh, it would still take you a hell of a long time. So putting a sleeping bag up here, it's pretty much like fucking yourself. <sighs> They're probably the sleeping bags of the brave workers of this giant tower as it goes into space. I'm wondering if that gray cloud is the sky limit, or if it's even deeper. Wasting too much time looking. The plan, when I first, you know, the first thought that came into my head before I started the climb was, you know, it looks tall, I got a screenshot. And uh, from what I could see, it didn't seem as high as I, you know, had imagined. I just thought it was gonna go like up to that mountain. And that was its limit. <clears throat> so I decided to make the climb, and I was going to say, at the top, I'm going to take a screenshot, and you should be able to see the whole island, and it'll be a great way to to map out, like, you know, Rust Island and where you are, kind of the areas, because the road is pretty much your, your map marker anyway. I mean, the road, there's only one road, and it seems to be a giant loop. Um, <clears throat> but anyway plan was to get to the top, take a screenshot, you know, kind of map it out, but I'm too high now, and I am not climbing this again, like I said, and uh, I forgot to take a screenshot about midway, because I was like, nah, you know, this isn't gonna, this isn't gonna reach, like, the clouds, this is just gonna go about to the mountain, I don't know why that, you know, that made sense in my head at the time, but... I just can't imagine the amount of wood required to build this fucking tower. You could have probably built a base the size of the island with the amount of wood that this tower used to be built. Good lord. Oh my god! I just dropped like three floors but holy shit that was scary it's not scary because I dropped because I was planning on jumping off at the top but just to think of all that work of climbing lost because I wanted to look and see if there was anything above my guy just doesn't stop. I'm, I can't see the top. I was hoping that there would be like some, you know, Dragon Ball Z 
Kami's house or Mr. Pooh, whatever the fuck, that guy's house up in the clouds on the top of the very tall tower. That would have been cool. You know, it didn't have to look like it. Just like a little house with like a, hey, you made the trek. Enjoy this, you know, meat because you're probably starving from fucking walking a billion fucking miles. Yeah. No torch. I'm hungry. 365 food and dwindling down rapidly. Well, not too rapidly, but <sighs> daytime's finally coming in. Took forever. And I'm no closer to the top than I was when I stopped to look and fell. That was pretty, uh, I felt the adrenaline rushing through my blood, falling. But no more scares and no more delays. We gotta get going. To the top. Can't fail now. And there's gotta be an end. If there's a beginning, there's an end. beat the sun. No, it's beating me. Another sleeping bag. Furnace. You'd think every sleeping bag you come across, you're like, yes, this must mean a halfway mark. It's gotta be a halfway point. Nope. It's just some guy that's like, fuck it, I'm logging out, and I'm not reclimbing this. Well, not really. I guess you, when you log out, you're pretty much where your character is at the time. So if he died, this is exactly where he'd respawn. It's right on the stairs. To me, that would just be like the shittiest. Just getting killed and then having to make the descent down. Especially if you had good loot. There's no way you're going to get to your body before the other guy did. What's this now? More sleeping bags, more chimneys. Oh my god, did... I did? Oh my god. I did it. I reached the top. This is such an accomplishment. Oh my god. Look at that. I did it. There's no more. No more fucking stairs. No more fucking stairs. Oh my god. That was so worth it. But I was hoping for a little ramp. But I said I'd jump from the top. And by god. I'm going to jump from the top. But which side should I jump from? Let's see our options. I just don't want to accidentally choose one forcefully. Okay. Hmm. I'm kind of liking the first one. And I hope you guys will too. Because it's what I'm choosing. And I'm never making this climb again. So... Kudos to the uh, crazy asshole that decided to build this. But here's my picture proof of the top. And some screenshots. Should have taken that while I was over there. It's for Steam. I want to stall step for man. One giant leap. For mankind. <sighs> oh my god, I can control it. This is fucking marvelous. Oh yeah, look at that. Oh my god, that's so cool. I bet you only a very few people get to experience this crazy shit. Mmm right on that house.
Or the road. Fuck it. Oh. My god. What the fuck? I didn't die. Holy shit. Holy shit. Holy shit. Holy shit. Holy shit. How did the fuck did I not die? Oh my god. <sighs> Holy shit. That was... That was... That was awesome. God, this game is so fucking cool. Alright, well, I'm gonna starve and probably die. So, hope you all enjoyed as much as I did.